What's up, YouTube? It's the dawn, where shit gets real. And today, just gonna be talking some shit. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on right now. People getting shot, getting shot at the courthouse. Uh, police officers got shot. Brothers is getting shot, you know, dude in his car, dude outside panhandling, whatever, I mean, selling CDs, you know, a lot of, it. I'm going I'm to tell y'all this, two things, one, the interaction with police officers, okay, um, I grew up in the inner city, so I had to deal with, and when I grew up, I was doing dirt, like, I'm telling you straight up right now, statute of limitations is up for all the stupid shit that I didn't did. But, <clears throat> you know, when I went to work, I went out on the street. So, I dealt with cops a lot. Okay? And I still deal with cops. Now, I live out, I live way far from that shit. I, I, don't, I live in a, a different world compared to, you know, what some of you guys may live in or what you guys see on the news. And a lot of America don't understand the anger in the black community. The anger's, the anger's there because, you know, we dealt with that day in and day out. You know, there's all, don't get me wrong, not all cops is bad. You know, there's a cop, you know, cops in the, in the neighborhood that, you know, know everybody's name, go check on the elderly people. There's good cops. But for the most, you know, you know, a small, small percentage of them are fucked up. It's just fucked up, but that's like just like in anything. Like I worked at UPS, you know, 90% of my drivers were good drivers. You know, 10% of them were fucked up. They would steal shit, you know, I would fire them, you know, but they were in the union so they would get their job back. I mean, so it's just, it's just reality. You know, not all people in, in each profession are gonna be good. You know, there's some accountants out there, they're, they're great accountants, but a couple of them fucked up. So, <clears throat> let me take it to them. But to get off that, let me tell y'all something. People, especially people that look like me, people of color, when you get pulled over from by the police, don't pull that YouTube, Facebook, Instagram shit, know your rights, am I being detained, I don't have to show you, I don't have to talk to you, all that bullshit. Listen, that cop is doing his job, okay? So your goal is trying to get from A to B, wherever you're trying to get to. You didn't left A, get to B. Don't be sitting there arguing with no fucking cop because he pulled you over. Don't be pulling that Facebook shit. Let the man do his job. His job is to give you tickets. You know, everybody's a suspect to him. You know, so give you tickets, tell you you're speeding, blah, 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 whatever his job may be. So when he pull you over, me personally, if I see the lights behind me, I'm pulling up my wallet, putting it on the seat next to me. Before I even stop the car, I'm reaching in my pocket, driving, throwing it on the seat. If it's hot, turn the air conditioner all the way up, roll down all your windows. Right? That way the mother, the cop can see in the car. Roll down all the windows, you got the AC blasting, point it right at you, so you ain't sweating. If it's, if it's cold, turn the heat up. Roll all the windows down. Put your hands on the stern wheel. Don't say nothing to him. Let him come up to you. Don't be like, yo, why you pulling me over? Or holding your cell phone like this, recording. Yo, why you pulling me over? Don't get into all that bullshit. Be smart. You know, you got, buy yourself a camera if you're concerned or this is an everyday or monthly occurrence, weekly occurrence. Buy yourself a, a, a dash cam. I got one point in that way and one point in that way. So, you know, how you doing, officer? He gonna ask you for your license and registration before he even tell you. Uh, some of them will, but he gonna ask you for your license and registration. Tell him where is that? Hey, man, if I get it, it's right there on the seat. Move slowly, give him what he, you need to give him. Put your hands back on the steering wheel. Then he gonna tell you, hey, you know what? He gonna ask you that stupid question. Do you know why I pulled you over? We already know it's a stupid question. Fuck no, I don't know why the fuck you pulled me over. Unless you know you were speeding, you went through a light. But don't even sit there and try to play judge, court, jury, jury. Don't do that. Oh, I pulled you over because you, you didn't make a complete stop. Oh, okay. You know, uh, 
you know, might give him a little excuse or, 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 or fess up. Yeah, I did. Blah, 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 blah. If you say, yeah, you did, a lot of times the cops be like, yeah, he know he did it. You know, they might just give you a warning. But if you're sitting there going back and forth with him, they gonna be like, this motherfucker think I'm stupid. I'm gonna write this motherfucker the biggest ticket I can give him and let me look around and see what else I can find. So just comply. Comply with whatever they asking for, all right? Another thing, you know, as vapors, some of us don't need to be buying fucking vape mods that look like gun handles. Don't do that shit. Like me, I, vi I visit the city all the time. There's no way I'm gonna buy a fucking vape. Bad enough, this looks like a gun. If I do like this, if I, if I pick this up like this, you know, a cop look at that shit, he might think it's a weapon. So, your mods, put them on the seat next to you where your wallet is. Don't be holding them between your legs because if you reach for it, they don't know what the fuck you reaching for. Not everybody knows where the fucking vaporizer is. Don't tell me that you still go places and people don't say, well, what is that? Or somebody says, oh, that's a that's an e-cigarette. This is not an e-cigarette, okay? So, but you know, people, a lot of people don't know what this is. Or they say, oh, that's big. I'm used to seeing... So, if you reach it for something that looks like this, you know, or this, you know, that could... It could look like a taser. They don't know what the fuck it is. So, don't be reaching for that. I hate to see the fucking next thing. Oh, the motherfucker was reaching for his, his DNA 200 and fucking got lit up. Um... So, a lot of us, y'all have no reason buying no fucking gun-looking vape. Now, some of us, or some of you, can get away with that shit. Y'all live in the rural area, y'all, you know, y'all hunt all the time. Y'all might can get away with that shit. But an inner-city black young kid, young guy, young man, because kids shouldn't be vaping. Young man, living in the inner city, you know, pass on that shit. I know it's fucked up, you should be able to get what you want, but if you do get it, don't take that shit out the house. Because you take that shit out the house, you know, where I'm from, you know, you pull out something that even look like a gun, you better be ready to use it. You on the wrong block, wrong street, wrong corner, you pulling out some shit that look look like a gun, you might get wet up. So don't don't even play those games. Um, and trust me, it ain't no fucking gun out, I mean no uh, mod that look like a gun out there worth buying right now, to me, that's my opinion. That's worth buying. You know, get something. Get something classy looking or something. You know, step your game up. This ain't about... Step your game up. That, that's some bullshit. Anyway, you know, just, just comply. Because them cops, when they pull you over, believe me when I say to you, they are already there. Adrenaline's pumping. They... Because they don't know who's in the car. Even though they could ran your, t your tags, they don't know who's driving that car. They don't know what state of mind you in. They don't know. So, you got to, for one, let the people that's doing that, that uh, know your constitutional rights, let them people do that shit. Let them people play that fucking game. You you know, don't play that fucking game. Because half of y'all that's looking at that shit don't know all the fucking, your, all your rights. So, you sitting there preaching half your rights and you, you just repeating the same thing over and over and over again. Your ass gonna be preaching your fucking rights in Central Booking somewhere because you aggravated the fuck out of somebody with that bullshit. The motherfucker just, you know, I, I, I didn't see so many crazy videos and it's like, why are you fucking promoting conflict? T to me, this is conflict. Get your fucking ticket, have your day in court. You know, they, I mean, if you're doing wrong, you're doing wrong. Shit, you know to do right. I mean, shit, we all do wrong. We all speed. We all roll through stoplights. We all have fucking busted tail light. Not busted, but tail lights that's out, headlights that's out. That shit, part of life. You know, you got a fancy enough car, it'll tell you, hey, headlight out. Right, right, left headlight. It'll tell you. Sometimes, you know, these regular cars that regular human beings got, they don't tell you that. You riding around, you don't know your light out, but the cop telling you that you're like, you pull you over and let you know your light out. So don't always be tripping. You're going to get yourself caught up. Don't live in that fucking YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Insta chat, whatever the fuck them shits is. Uh, uh, video, I don't know, whatever they are. Don't live like that. 
live normal. You, you trying to get home, you trying to get to work, 10 minutes out of your life gone. So the fuck what you gonna be late? Tell your boss you got pulled over by police. Hey, so what? Ain't there's nothing that pressing worth your life or you getting fucking teased, shot, beat up. And them cops, they don't be playing, you know, you fucking resist with a cop nowadays, they, they gonna whip your ass. It, it ain't no, it, it ain't too many jokers out here that's gonna win that fight, you know what I mean? Um, and plus they got backup with cars that's gonna get right to the scene. Like, I got backup, you know I got call my back, it might take him 20 minutes to get in the shower or, or 10 minutes to put on his shoes, tell his people he's leaving. They got backup that's like instantaneous. <laughs> Yo, I need help. The motherfuckers going through lights. They coming to help whip your ass. So don't get your ass whipped. Just comply. Now I gotta. I'm gonna finish this video up because I'm pulling up to my real estate office to get some get some uh, awards. Even though I don't practice real estate that much, still getting awards. But I gotta get up here and get this award. Um, but yeah, I'm. A, I'm a, I will. I will finish this video tomorrow because this is an important. Subject. Let me take a toe. Blow your cloud before I go. Blow your cloud. Blow your little baby cloud. Damn, this sun is crazy. Got this Eagle tank in this fucking, uh, what is this thing? It's a DNA 75. It takes two batteries. Got a little leather case. Lost feet. This thing is nice. <clears throat> I like it. I like it. So far. But anyway, till the next time, if you can, help, help, help somebody out and pay it forward.